hi welcome to this video tutorial and of course i remain moses in today's video tutorial i'll be introducing you to what we call elementor templates the main use of elementor templates is to ease your work to ease your process instead of designing all the way from scratch you can just pull in a template and we adjust it to fit what you want to do so i'm going to log into my main website which is masterclass.name.ng slash wp admin to log into my main website not the subdomain now my main website by now i believe you've developed your blog website and your business website on one of your subdomains now you need to head to plugins and click on add new And you want to search for what we call the Envato element. Just search for Envato. And see right here, we have Envato elements, photos, and elemental templates. Click on install now and activate. Cool. Now let's let me create a new page. I'm going to come to pages. And I'm going to create a new page. Add new page. I'm going to call this. Let me just call this contact. I'm going to click on Elemental Fluid. I'm going to click on Publish. Publish. After doing that, I'm going to open this in another tab. Edit with okay. Let me just open this dashboard in another tab and click on edit with Elementor. I'm going to come back here. And what we want to do is find this element, hover over it, and click on free kits. I'm going to click on free kits. And you need to select the kit that works best for what you want to develop. So I'm going to come to categories and I want to work with, let me go to technology. And I'll just select this, Dicta product. I'm going to click on preview. And we have this young man right here. Now, how do you use this template? Let's assume how to work with this one. All I need to do is come back here and click on install kit. As you can see right here, install kit. Now I've installed the kit. I'll come back to this page and I'm going to reload this particular page. So how do I make use of all these installed kits? All I need to do is click on this icon right here. This one, go to click on it. It brings me here. I've only installed one kit. I click on view installed kit. I can always come here to check what I want to install as you can see. Okay, probably I want to work with this one. I want to work with this one. And the name is Home 2. I want to work with Home 2. I'm going to come back here. This is Home 2 right here. I'm going to click on Insert Template. And we're going to wait for that to insert or to import now this is done importing as you can see i just imported a template right to my page without designing anything as simple as that as you can see so if i click on update and i click on preview we have this guy without me building anything so you can work with this template to come up with a structure this is just a basic structure that you can work with and stuff like that so you can work with it to design your website and import templates and stuff like that to make things easy for you that's one beautiful thing about web design and web development using wordpress you don't have to create everything from scratch you can always use existing templates and build on it to build your personal website so this is a template Another thing is, let me undo what I did here. I'm going to go back to blank canvas. Let's assume you don't want to use a full template. I can always click here, come to free blocks. And we have all these free blocks. 
I've come to hero section. I can decide to insert one of these. Let me insert this template. Just this is just a block hero section. Cool. I just imported this without developing anything. I can decide to import another block. Come to free blocks. And this time around to import something like Hmm, let's see, let's see. Features and benefits. And I want to work with this. I'm going to click on insert template. And it has been inserted. Imagine I'm just trying to pull up a structure right here. As simple as that. So templates just hate you to build structure without actually starting from scratch you can build on it i can try to just edit all this guy edit them edit the content change this image edit this change the content change the color and stuff like that and i'm building my website i can build the whole landing page by just importing templates one by one from free blocks or i decide to use a full kit to build my website you understand so if i come to install kits instead of creating my contact page from scratch and decide to scroll all the way down and use one of the contact page templates here if i should preview it here scroll all the way down as you can see this is a contact page this is a contact template so let's work with that let's come back here close this i'm going to undo all what i did i'm going to come back here and edit editing started i'm going to come back to my template we installed kit scroll all the way down so which of the template you want to work with contact two as you can see this template even came with its own pop-up so i want to work with contact two this one right here insert template as simple as that as you can see i just imported a contact page template without developing anything you can go ahead to edit this text change the color stuff like that edit the um I did the form and I'll be good if I should update this and I view my website right here Stephanie in as simple as a b c so this is what elemental templates can be used for you can import a template and build on it to build your own personal website now the good thing about template is you have to know how to customize elemental that is why i first taught you how to use elemental before introducing you to elemental templates because i know if i should have introduced the template from the beginning most of you just be using the templates you will learn how to work with elemental itself so now you know how to use elemental and you know what templates are so you can combine your skills of elemental and that of working with templates to build a well tailored website this is where we are going to stop for this video tutorial. Of course, I remain Moses and I'll see you in the next.